What up guys, it's your boy Lardy Wise back here again with another video. Um, this time, we're getting back to it, man. We're getting back to the dreads, man. We're getting back to dreadhead Lardy. It's been, it's been a few years, it's been a few years since I cut them, and uh, I've had some good times. I had some good times with the fro, but I do not like my fro no more. It's, it's all over the place, it's unmanageable, it's thick, it's just a mess, and it's just time. Sorry if I'm a little sweaty, I just came from outside. It's time. Uh, my girlfriend's been wanting me to get the dreads. I miss them. I just felt like my first version of them just got a little long, a little, uh, a little heavy, a little too much to bear. We're going back to them, man. So I know y'all seen me with different hairstyles, different color hair and stuff like that, and just different kind of things going on with my hair, and I appreciate my baby for doing that for me throughout the couple years and stuff like that and keeping me looking clean. But it's time to go back to the dreads, man. It's time to uh, restart these hoes, man. It's It's time to restart that journey so we're gonna do that she's gonna twist me up get them uh get them started and you know we'll see how long it take me to get back to where i was i think i'm gonna try to keep them shoulder length but we'll we'll see how it goes but that's gonna be the goal maybe i'll do like once a month we'll do like a dread update video or something like that maybe i'll record a few of my retwist sessions or something like that and you know we'll just kind of make it a story you know what i'm saying we get back to super saiyan 3 lady you know what i'm saying so uh you know what i mean i'm gonna be uh what is it ko ken i'm gonna be ko ken as we started started out but make our way back up to Super Saiyan 3. Uh, yeah, and uh, yeah, man, that's just, I just wanted to do a nice little update, you know, a little hair update and stuff like that. And uh, we're just gonna keep pushing it, man. Uh, can't wait to see how they come out this time and uh, can't wait to experience the journey again. It was 10 years last time, so, you know, hopefully we can get another 10 years in with this. And uh, yeah, man, Dreadhead Lardy is on his way back. He on his way back. But uh, I just wanted to give y'all a little update. Let y'all know what the plans are, and we're just going to keep pushing it, all right? Appreciate y'all, and uh, enjoy the video, all right? Let's get it. And as usual, please, 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 please hit that subscribe button. And if you care to know when I upload a video, hit that notification bell as well. And uh, leave your boy a like, man. Comment. Let your boy know, you know what I'm saying? If y'all starting y'all dread journey and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Let me know, you know what I'm saying? Link, link me to a video or something. Show, let's, let's, let's journey together with the dreads, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. All right? Sexy love, girl, the things you do keep me sprung, keep me running back to you. Oh, I love, I'm making love to you. Oh, girl, you make me say sexy love. Turn your black ass up. She's talking shit. I'm putting these in conditioning your hair because I don't want your hair too soft so I put conditioning actual like the conditioner. She's trying to drown me, y'all. Y'all see it. I got no care, man. She's trying to drown me. <laughs> Boy! <laughs> Come on. Hey. Okay. 
But y'all see how my hair is now? You know what I'm saying? Stick and shit. Um, stick, man. I'll go crazy. Crazy. Big, long. Crazy, but I go crazy, but young Einstein, bro. Hey, lover. <laughs> Don't pay attention to my kitchen, bro. Get out of my kitchen. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? situation ain't happening if I'm not. No, I'm saying like your child told me to get out of here after this. 
After that, baby, that's not happening if I'm there at all. How? That's the man she married to or whoever. Like, I'm the father. Like, who is that? No. First of all, that nigga would be dead. <laughs> He'd be dead, baby. Oh. That man will be going to jail. I will be going to jail. <laughs> Person, boy. <laughs> what? The side of me that come out, boy. I swear, boy. Look at all this stuff. <laughs> I'm not stupid, sis. And I'm not weak. I can take care of myself, my kids, <laughs> this baby if I have to. I just need to know do you still have one foot in another door? I have both feet planted right here, Brenda. I'm not going in. Freda, stay out of the house for the rest of the day and maybe go see your son. What do you think of that? You know, now is not the best time for you to start using your intelligence. If something like that from you, you would never forgive us. Yes, I promise you, I will tell everybody soon. Some little kinky had a grandchild from their 16 year old daughter. Oh, whoa, okay, look, Mom, take it easy. I wish I could, Dingus. I wish that I could take my eyes off of you for one minute. The people who love him. Not yet. Not yet. Damn. Miss Frenchford, you've seen this crap before. I told Charlotte she's got more of me in her than she'd like to admit. I would have killed this nigga. Just like she trying. I would have killed this nigga. I don't give a fuck. I tell you, I'm not feeling all that well. You hurt my child severely. I look spectacular. To the point where my child hurt herself. And, I'm that and then he's talking about what she was doing. I'm paying for all this shit. And she ain't testified on me. So, nah, if he's talking like that, I'll eat. He would have got worse than that last one. You want square parts or diamond parts? 
Sitting there patronizing and fucking getting man. Sorry. Boy. He, the white man probably patronized him. Oh yeah. <laughs> the wife did. I mean the the ex, the baby mama didn't do that. I know. Yeah. We know it was the white boy. Yeah. Who else would it be? Cause the, the woman wasn't gonna do that. She knew what kind of jail trouble that nigga was in. Now white man knew that shit too. That's why he was trying to sit there, get him uh, mad and shit. He knew what was gonna happen. No white man. As soon as he hit me, I'm calling the cops. <laughs> he was ready. He had the cops on speed, dog. You. We got to the police. I promise you. Got like 30 witnesses there that heard that girl's statement. So. That nigga going to jail. Go and make him. You show her that not all the. Got his confession to the wife. He admitted to beating on him, so. Done deal. Is only available with us. That nigga would have got killed. Mm -hmm. 
That's that's traumatizing to a young girl. Uh, it's traumatizing to a young girl. So just a young child in general, like teenage, like even her boy. <laughs> Almighty boy. Your hair you got like some diamond parts going on. So, <sighs> yeah, you done. Yeah. Yeah, as you can see, they're, they're done. They're done. They're not locked, obviously. Obviously, we just got them twisted, but came out pretty good. It's a lot less on my head than when I first got my dreads the first time, so this should be a lot more manageable compared to the last time. But yeah, uh, I recorded as much as I could. The process itself, we took maybe like three breaks. <laughs> so we were doing, we were doing this from like four in the afternoon to like midnight. It honestly shouldn't have took that long, but because we took so many breaks and then we were watching movies and stuff like that, it just made the process a lot longer. I'm sitting, we sitting there watching like horror movies and a bunch of drama on TV. So I'm like steadily trying to look up and watch the TV and she has to keep pushing my head down and stuff. But the process is done. We're looking good. You know what I'm saying? Let me do a, let me do a quick little 360. You know what I'm saying? Do a little 360 for y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Um, the process was was fairly long, so I didn't record everything. I pretty much recorded like the first half or some something like that, the first hour or something of me getting it twisted. So I was acting a fool because that shit hurt. I'm tender headed, so that shit hurt for a bit. And a few few spots, especially around my edges, I get to acting wild. Man, shout out to my baby, man. She gonna keep me right too. So I don't know. I don't really know where, I wanna say maybe in a couple months they'll be, you know, maybe somewhere right here. I don't know how fast my hair is gonna grow now compared to when I was younger in my 20s. So it might take a little longer or whatever, but I'm expecting them to lock up at least in like a month, maybe like a month and a half or something like that. Yeah, man. I mean, this is this is the beginning of the journey. Like I said, I want to do like maybe like monthly monthly lock journey videos or something like that, just to have some extra content on the channel. So I'm thinking like maybe like every first first week of the month or something, I find some time to make a you know what I'm saying, make an update. You know what I'm saying, let y'all know where the status is. Obviously, y'all gonna see you know as time goes by, and more videos I upload, y'all be able to see my hair length getting longer and longer. I'm hoping it really grows like my last set, but we'll see. Like I said, you know, I, you know, we get older, you know, you, your body's a little different. You eat a little different. You may not, you know what I'm saying? You may not have the same metabolism as you had when you was younger, but you know, 
I, I said it was it was just time. I, I just wasn't feeling the fro. Anytime I had the fro out, it was just nappy, matted up, BDBs everywhere, just hard to pick through, hard to comb through. It was just it was just a mess to me. But I did enjoy all the braid styles. Y'all can go back and watch all my old videos and stuff like that over the past year. Just the different little hairstyles that I had, plaits. I had the white hair. I had the green hair. I had the blue hair. I still wanted to try like silver or like gray, maybe even like orange or something, just something different, but it's all right, we ain't, ain't a big deal to me. Yeah, man, like I said, we're gonna, we gonna try to keep with some uh, Dread Journey video, Log Journey videos, and uh, yeah, man, this this is just the, just, just the beginning, you know what I'm saying? We already got some length because my hair was already long, so we ain't gotta go through that ugly stages of them looking like little turds on my head, so that's a good thing. I was, that's the one thing I was kind of fearing. I didn't know how the beginning of it was gonna be. I didn't know they were gonna be like short or if they were gonna be longer. You know, I got some hang time, so we, we chilling, we chilling for right now. So again, look out for the log journey videos. Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed, you know, the little bit that I could record of me getting my, my dress uh, retweeted I've been telling my girl over and over, you know, upload some videos to your TikTok or Instagram of you doing hair and stuff like that. You never know who will see your stuff and be like, hey, I want her to do my hair. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to my baby. Uh, go follow her on TikTok, Instagram and stuff like that for more like beauty stuff, uh, influencer stuff, hair stuff, stuff like that. Yeah, man. I'm excited about this log journey, man. I have been thinking about this for quite a while because I had cut my dreads, but you know, I was like, all right, let me, let me see what I can do over the next two, three years. And I was rocking an afro for like two years until I met my girlfriend and then she started styling me up with hairstyles. So, you know, it's it's good to be back to the locks. It should be easier on her. It should be easier on me. And yeah, man, it should just be a, a good old time, man. I, I just enjoy having long hair. I just, I don't like having my hair short and nappy. Well, it's going to be nappy because I'm a Negro, but you know what I'm saying? It is what it is, you know what I mean? But anyway, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all checking out the video, man. Please, 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 please leave a like. Do not leave a dislike. Please leave a comment down there somewhere for your boy. And please, 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 please hit that subscribe button. And if you care to know when I upload a video, please hit that notification bell as well. And uh, yeah, man, join a nigga for the journey, man. We Right now, we at, we at Goku. We at base Goku right now. We at base Goku right now, you know what I'm saying? Next level should be Kyle Ken. And after that, we'll hit Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan 2, and then hopefully Super Saiyan 3, which is going to be past my shoulders. We'll get there. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I appreciate y'all. appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Shout out to the new subscribers. Shout out to the people just showing love to the channel, man. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. I'm out this hoe. All right? Deuces.